Hello, I'm Alex, the UDOT Project Manager for the Bangor Highway Environmental Study. Last time you heard from me, we were just kicking off a study to identify a new freeway style design, one without stoplights, for Bangor Highway between 4100 South and West Valley City and California Avenue in Salt Lake City. This is the last remaining section of Bangor to be studied for the conversion to freeway style interchanges, with construction scheduled to begin in 2028. Because traffic on Bangor is expected to double by 2050, our project will improve congestion, safety, and quality of life by upgrading the highway now, all while minimizing impacts to the environment around it. To determine what the new highway design could look like, we compiled traffic and engineering data, analyzed potential environmental impacts, and gathered community feedback. Based on this information, the study team put together four design concepts. After a close review, we've determined that the concept that meets our traffic goals is economical to construct and has the least impact to the community is what we are calling option B, interchanges. This design includes constructing on and off ramps at 4100 South, 3500 South, 2700 South, also known as Parkway Boulevard, SR201, 1820 South, and California Avenue. Due to the spacing required between freeway interchanges, this design also means that access on and off Bangor from 3100 South and 2400 South would no longer be available. However, traffic could still travel east and west across these two cross streets without a traffic signal. It was important that we understood what removing access to and from Bangor at those cross streets would mean for traffic, and we found that less than one minute of additional travel time would be added by using the interchanges north or south of these two areas instead. Next, feedback from the public and city officials told us that the community prefers Bangor to go under the cross streets where possible. While we're not able to do this for most of the segment because of high ground water levels, our study showed that we have a unique opportunity to have Bangor go under 4100 South. We'll be able to lower Bangor slightly and raise 4100 South, limiting the visual barrier for the community. Finally, from the beginning, we set out to improve transportation not only for drivers, but also people who walk, bike, and roll in West Valley and Salt Lake City. As part of option B, a new shared use path will run along Bangor. This path will connect to existing pedestrian infrastructure on the north and south ends of the project, improving connectivity and safety for people traveling without a car. So now that we've identified a design, we need your feedback. More details about the improvements and what they mean for drivers, residents, business owners, and property owners are available on our website and in the draft environmental study at udot.utah.gov slash Bangor 4100 to California. We invite you to review the maps and materials and join us at one of our upcoming events to provide input and ask questions. You can attend a public hearing online Monday, June 12th from 6 to 7 p.m. or in person at Granger High School on Wednesday, June 14th or Thursday, June 15th from 6 to 7.30 p.m. each night. You can also find our team at locations throughout the community between June 15th through the 24th. Details about these events are on our website. If you own or rent property that may be impacted by this new design, You'll be contacted directly by the study team and have several opportunities to discuss your individual situation throughout the remainder of the study, which is slated to wrap up this summer. As always, please don't hesitate to contact us with questions or to provide feedback. We appreciate all the collaboration and engagement from the community in helping to develop this design and keep Utah moving on Bangor Highway.